Who would like to see some scans? Yeah, I would. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Great. This is a two-station chest, abdomen, pelvis. The coil was positioned so we didn't have to move the coil or the patient to get the full coverage. This image was acquired with two scans, two stations pasted into one image. I think the image resolution is, is wonderful. It's probably some of the best I've seen in a chest, abdomen, pelvis. It's amazing yeah, that you can amazing. include everything. I don't think you can get much better coverage than that either. There's no cutoff. Let's move on to the interography exam. It looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. Yeah. It's amazing. Wow. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful yeah. images. Yeah. What do you think of the overall quality of the image? It's great. It's yeah. very detailed. Is it detailed in a way that you couldn't see with a conventional coil? Yes. I'd have to say yes. Yeah, Absolutely. I would agree Recorded, with that. Yeah. Yeah. What about the scan time? 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Oh, wow. Wow, That's very amazing. fast. Let's move on now to two anterior arrays, the long bone. It looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. Yeah. You can't tell where they were stitched together at all. I mean, it's totally one fluid picture. Could you get an image like this with a conventional coil? Absolutely no, not. No way. If you tried, how long would it take you to get something like this? A while. Oh, probably three <laughs> times as long. Three times as long. Yeah. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Let's move on to an image of the female pelvis. I think the SIG signal looks great with that small of a field of view. Whereas with the conventional coil, you tend to lose a lot of signal. The anatomy is so so crisp and so clear. That it just, it looks great. I would say that the image resolution actually almost matches the signal to noise. The over, overall quality of that versus a conventional, I don't, I don't think it can be topped. 